We are back live here in Louisiana, and oh, here comes the game, Triple H. And right now, though, folks, it's going to be an all-out war here tonight, because here comes the game, the Cerebral Assassin, the King of Kings. Boy, what a matchup this is going to be. And, uh oh let's take it out ring announcer for the introductions. The Legion of the Fully Contest, a triple threat elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Cambridge, Connecticut. Weighing in at 255 pounds. Here's the game. Triple. Triple Threat Elimination Match. Remember, if Brock Lesnar loses here tonight, his, his advocate, Paul Heyman, will have a match with Juan Tejeda at TNW WrestleMania 8000 within one week from now. And right now, though, either Austin or Triple H win this match, they will be a part of the eight-man battle royal in one week. It's right now, though, folks, I am sorry to say this, but we have to take a break. Do not go anywhere. As soon as we come back, Brock Lesnar versus that man, Triple H, and the Texas Rattlesnake, Stone Cold Steve Austin, in this triple threat elimination match. We'll be right back here, folks. Stay with us. Brooklyn Bob Braun will be in the ring with both 
our Commissioner Rico, and our business partner Jenny Wakeman. And right now, though, that that on that week, Brooklyn Von Braun has to make a choice. Either is she returns Kurt Angle's 1996 Olympic gold medal and pay him fifty thousand dollars, or be kicked out of TNW. The, the choice team. is hers. Just right now, though, that's going to be a, a tough now position to for Brooklyn Von Braun to make. But we'll keep you posted on that. Soon may be available. And there's an arm drag from Triple H. And a running knee lift from the game. Brock Lesnar right now with the game in this triple threat elimination match. Brock Lesnar's been in the eight-man battle royal for the past two years. Has lost two of them already. Wait a minute, where's Austin going here? As there are no disqualifications. Wait a minute. Austin! He's got a baseball bat. There's no other way to describe Lesnar it. Lesnar with the right hand, taking that bat out of Austin's That's hands. Position to be in right now. He's got Austin on his shoulders. Oh, and a snake cool. eyes off the top turnbuckle. Yeah. And a back body drop. Oh, As we're coming to you live here from Louisiana, this triple threat elimination match, the war is spinebuster. Spinebuster by the game. Cover, is that it for Lesnar? One, two, no. Brock Lesnar kicked out at two and a half. And now Triple H with the bat. Rules and wait a minute. A Brock Lesnar's got the baseball bat. Try to swing for the fences. Wait a minute. Yeah. Triple H for the swing. It was going, going, gone out of the park. That was out of here. That was a grand slam. <laughs> and Austin with an arm drag on Triple H. And now Lesnar with Austin. And he rolls the dice, snake eyes. As we're coming to you live here from Louisiana, Austin with a clothesline. Another clothesline by the rattlesnake. Austin coming back, jumping clothesline. As you can tell, Paul Heyman is nowhere to be seen in this matchup today. As this matchup was made by the current TNW general manager, Juan Tejeda. Austin nailing those baseball bat shots to Lesnar. And Austin, that right hand to the game. Wait a minute, Lesnar back up. What's coming next? But he's got him. Back suplex, and down goes the beast. The Texas Rattlesnake's humming now. Last time we saw Brock Lesnar was 2019, when taking on Colt 412. Well, that's Drew Boy at ringside, and his advocate Paul Heyman at ringside. Which led to Lesnar losing to Cole 412 that night in a knee drop from the top. Cover, is that it for the Beast right there? One, two, no, and a kick out. The Beast refusing to stay down tonight. Oh, Austin's got that bat again. And Triple H knocking the bat right off his hands. No more the leg by the Rattlesnake. Rattlesnake right now sending him off the ropes. And now Lesnar looking on. And a backbreaker by Austin. And the Beast is fired up here. Stone Cold is going for it. Pile driver on Triple H. And the Beast is right now coming back. Oh, look at this. Rock Lesnar with a German suplex. He's not done yet. Two German suplexes. And Suplex City. It looks like Austin took a trip to Suplex City. Here's the cover. It does it for Austin. One, two. No, and Stone Cold stays alive. And the Beast cannot believe it. There's the setup. Triple H, I think I'm Austin now. Pedigree. Pedigree by the game. Cover is this it for Austin. Look at the leg. Two. And a shoulder up at two and a half. And a running STO by the game. Taking it to Lesnar. Spine buster by the game. Taking it to Stone Cold any way he can. Cover by the game is this it for Austin. Two. Three. Stone Cold Steve Austin has been eliminated. Get dangerous out here. Also eliminated from the match. And now it's down to Triple H. It is down to Lesnar. And now Lesnar has to give it his all to survive. Or he won't be going to the eight-man battle royal coming up in one week. Both men are giving it their all in this matchup. But 
the beast showing off his power. Oh my god, slamming Triple H on the other side of the stage. Oh, Triple H from behind. Oh my god, a neck breaker on the outside. Austin eliminated from the match, giving it his all, everything that he had. Matchup made by our general manager, wants to hate it, but uh oh. I think the game is calling for it. Pedigree, no. Lesnar countered it. And a belly to belly suplex by the Beast. Oh, he's got the bat. Look out. And he's swinging for the fences. And Triple H is down. And now Lesnar swinging. Swinging like with everything he's got with that bat. Trying to take the game's head off. He sends him to the corner. Wait a minute, he's got him up here. And a full away slam on the game. This one's got to be it for Triple H. The, the beast is just dominating Triple H. Just decimating the game. Not trying to make it for one week. And a suplex by Lesnar. Triple H is taking a hellishly beating at the hands of the Beast. Oh, wait a minute. What's Brock Lesnar doing here? He's calling for it. Wait a minute, he's got Triple H on his shoulders. Here it comes. The F5. The F5 by the Beast. Cover here. Two. No. And Triple H stays alive. Brock Lesnar can't believe. That Triple H got the shoulder up after that, after that devastating F5 by the Beast Incarnate. And now the Beast is continuing to dominate. Oh no, he's looking for a second F5 on the game. He's got him up. He's got him up. Here it comes. F5. Two F5s to Triple H. Cover here. Two. Three. And it looks like Brock Lesnar has survived. Brock Lesnar is once again in the eight-man battle royal. My God. Look at this. Both these men with everything they got. That was an incredible moment. When Triple H nailed the spine buster on the rattlesnake. Lesnar counter countering the pedigree into this F5 on the game. Here's your winner, Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar is going to TNW WrestleMania 8000. And it looks like the third and final spot has been filled in as the Beast has just punched his ticket for the eight-man battle royal. It's official. Three sides have been filled in for TNW. Kyle Behan, Goku, and that man, the Beast, Brock Lesnar. And you got to give a lot of credit to Brock Lesnar for surviving both men in the eight-man battle royal. And right now, though, folks, coming up next, our Diva Contest, as we see... Oh, wait a minute. We're being told from the floor that X-23... Is in one-on-one -on -one action. Now she'll be accompanied by Jay Reigns as she takes on none other than Lita. Oh boy, that matchup coming to you up next.